Let's talk about the rebel archetype. The rebel at the tribal level is that person, um, certainly through your childhood years and through your adolescence years, needs to keep on rebelling because that's their way of being noticed, that's their way of getting attention. Like some of the other archetypes, the level it's at of maturation will tell you um, which part you're playing out. If it's at the tribal level, you're being the child and you're stamping your feet and having a temper tantrum and I'm not getting my own way is the rebel at the tribal level. At the individuation level, it's that teenage part of you that's saying up yours to authority figure. No one's going to tell me what to do. No one's the boss of me. And so you'll, that's the marches, that's all the sort of things that you'll go out and rebel against. At the symbolic level, you've given up the need to rebel because you understand you've bought into the game, you've bought into what's going on in the world and instead you've learned how to go within and march to the beat of your own drum. Not the programs and the experiences that the outside world gives you, you've stopped buying into that reality. So at the symbolic level, there's no need to rebel because you're so congruent in your own being, you march to the beat of your own drum. There's nothing to rebel about, about because you understand at the symbolic level, you can create your own reality and you live by that truth and you become, the mind-heart connection becomes very strong and you manifest what it is that you want to bring about and how you want to live in your world, in your life. So there's no need to rebel because you're manifesting what it is that you want. Great place to be.